so hey guys welcome back to an another video on the vr hacks and uh, sorry for uploading the video after a certain period longer period of a time but we are back and in this video we are going to discuss about the ch practical exam version 13 so let me clear uh, let me clear uh, it first guys those who purchase the ch version 12 vouchers so they will going to give the exam for the ch v12 only not for the v13 and those who purchase the for the v13 so they are going to uh, give the exam for the v13 version okay and uh, the doubts which are uh, roaming in many people's minds like the question will be differ or like what will be so let me clear you guys there will not going to be any changes in the question set the question will come same as came in the previous uh, versions like v13 or v11 uh, only the chances are like they will uh, change the name of the users or they will change the ip address okay but the questions uh, set will be same okay so without wasting time we are going to start this video and in this video i'm going to uh, show you how that 20 question will come and how you can solve that questions and uh, you can easily crack the exam so let me just open my i class uh, which is my i labs and those who purchase the voucher from the ac council so with the i lab subscription so uh, once you will log in with your screen in the right hand side you can see there is the option like allied package resources okay so you need to click on here and now once you click on the allied package resources you will able to access your labs okay you will able to access your lab but here all the 20 modules first you need to complete then only you will be able to understand all the like what is enumeration what is vulnerability analysis what is system hacking so the person who are going to cover this video like eric red he already discuss already uh, discuss everything in details okay so not to jump directly make sure to complete all the 20 modules before giving the practical or the theory exam so now let's come to the points like from where you can access your lab so as you can see i already uh, completed my exams and i already uh, gained my certifications practical master all so now let's come to the point again so as you can see here there are multiple options e course fair simulation exam certificate pending xx okay so now what you have to do as you can see here there is an option global ch engage so click on simply click on here on the global ch challenge and once you will click here there will be a four modules okay as you can see ch part one two three four you need to complete all these four modules to get ready for the practical exam so make sure do not jump directly to give the practical exam but if you already uh, working in a cyber security field or you already aware about the vulnerabilities VAPT what is reconnaissance enumeration footprinting system hacking and you are well known aware about the ports what is ports hacking all this then you can maybe chances that you can go okay and exam is not that hard so if you are thinking that it will be very tough so don't worry once you will complete all the four modules now so it will be very easy for you to give the practical exam so let me open the my first module cause in the first module there are 20 sets of questions are there okay another lab is currently please save or system hacking okay let me close this lab first system hacking one so yeah let me first close this lab then only we'll able to access uh, this one ch engage part one and uh, make sure guys uh, let me also tell you that if you want to access like github repositories or youtube or any kinds of uh, resources you want to use you can use but make sure do not to uh, uh, like uh, make a set of uh, like if you already know that uh, what kind of question will going to be asked or anything such can so do not to make a notes of all that but yeah you can use the github or like github repositories you can use and then youtube also you can use you can use uh, 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 other free resources if you are getting uh, if you are getting stuck between the exams okay but make sure do not to uh, like uh, use any uh, handwritten notes okay if they will uh, saw that you are using any handwritten notes immediately they will after three warning they will uh, like uh, terminate your session and uh, you need to uh, you need to discuss with your examiner proctors and chances are like that they will be agree to give the exam again and you will lose you will lose your money so make sure do not to use the handwritten notes but apart from that you can use the resources free resources on the internet like youtube github then notions and uh, little bit of chat gpt also you can use not little bit but yeah you can use the chat gpt so let the lab environment getting be built and uh, those who don't have ILAPS, okay. Those who don't have ILAPS, they only purchase the coupon for the practical exam. So for them, they can use the HTB machines, hack the box. Then apart from that, you they can also use the Kali Linux. I will give all these machines like Academy, Blue, Butler, Dev. These all machines with the help of these all machine, you can <coughs> increase, inc improve your like uh, VAPT skills, reconnaissance, enumerations. You can do the uh, scanning, uh, doing um, uh, attacks on these machines 
okay so while solving these machines also you can get ready for the practical exams <coughs> okay so we'll wait for the one minute more to get it done in this uh, lab there will be 20 question as i told you so let me clear you one thing more guys the exam set will be same like as you are watching my screen a uh, same question same uh, like uh, uh, how i to how, how should i explain you the, as you can see here the same thing you are going to uh, uh, see in the exam also in the right side of your panel you will get this 20 question this is just a demo question not a real exam question so make sure not to uh, like uh, prepare only for this make sure to prepare for all these four modules okay so yeah so uh, let me clear there will be two machines one machine will be the window and the second machine will be your parrot machine there will be no kali linux machine and you cannot use any external monitor or the linux kali linux machine in your external devices okay so uh, make sure about this point so as you can see the one machine will be our parrot machine and the second machine will be our windows machine in the exam also you will get the same things so what we are going to do now the first question which is related to in my same because i gave the ch version 12 one so the first question which will come is going to be uh, for the uh, nmap okay the first question will going to be asked you the nmap here as you can see they are saying you are performing the reconnaissance for the chorg has been dash 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 xyz but in your case their chances are 110 percent chances are that they will ask you the for the nmap question and there you uh, you will going to get the three ips okay you will going to get the three ip address from that three ip address you need to identify the uh, like domain okay so you need to do product version of the domain you need to identify so simply you, what you have to do let me tell you you need to just type the nmap hyphen sv for the service version okay yeah for the service version hyphen uh, t4 to get the scanning as quick as possible and then you can also uh, not also it's a mandatory command for aggressive scan then only you will going to get the all the uh, complete details of your target then the ip address of all the uh, between the three ip address there will be one ip address in which you will going to get in the all the three ip address you will going to get the domain product version but in that three ip address one 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 will going to be correct okay so same command you need to perform the nmap hyphen sv for the service version t4 to get your scan as quick as possible hyphen a for the aggressive scan and just simply define the ip address which will going to given in the exam okay so you're going to give the three ip address simply click on the enter button that's it once you click on the enter button you will going to get the product version of the domain okay so as you can see the no targets were specified because i'm giving just a random ip address that's why it's giving me this warning that no target were specified or the host scan now to come to the second questions the second question also related will be the rdp okay so second in the second question is going to be the related to the rdp questions what you have to do you need to first identify on which port or sorry on which ip address the rdp port is open 555 like uh, you can simply do the google also let me show rdp you can simply do you can simply go and do the rdp ports once you will know get to know that the 3389 port is uh, related to idp what you have to do you need to simply scan the ip address okay so what you can do simply do the nmap hyphen sv for the service version again then hyphen p just simply define the 3389 which is the rdp port okay and simply give the ip address like the ip address will be this and also define the subnet that's it click on the enter button once you click on the uh, enter button you will going to get the ip address on which that the idp port is running okay so we are this you can also uh, like solve the question the second one so my uh, in my in this video i'm just want to uh, clarify you that you can use the github you can use the youtube you can use the other resources also but make sure do not use the handwritten notes apart from that the question scenario will become same as you can see here in my screen the third step is going to be uh, like you you will not able to uh, give the answer after the three attempts for example if i click on one and click on the submit and check incorrect if i'll two i'm just giving the example if i'll uh, if i'll do the three now if in if in your fourth attempt if in your fourth attempt you are giving the right answer also then also you will not be able to submit and check and you will going to lose your uh, that 10 marks okay so make sure to not uh, give the wrong answer after the three attempts if you will going to give the uh, right answer also it will going to uh, like it will not going to accept your that answer so make sure it is a very important point okay so uh, now in the last before closing uh, before closing the video my just point is that make sure 
to not take as much time so uh, hardly take 10 to 15 minutes for the one question and the most of the questions are related to uh, as i told you the nmap wireshark sql map and uh, dwwa in the last uh, there is the one question which is related to the wi-fi one and uh, those who are uh, like uh, uh, those who are like uh, still confused that how you will going to get the user and the password for the brute force attack so do not to be worried there will be a folder name word list in the word list you will open in the desktop only you will going to get the username username as you can see as a uh, username like this and the password will be also going to provide you here only okay so you can use this username and the password for the brute force attack using the hydra or the john the ripples you can use okay so hope you understand guys if you have any doubt related to the ch practical exam you can simply comment me on my description or you can also join my telegram uh, group where i uh, post uh, daily updates related to ch practical exams uh, okay so that's it for today guys uh, we'll meet in the another video with the top 20 question which is asked uh, in the exam and i'm going to solve all that 20 question not a real based exam but uh, related to scenario based exam questions i'm going to solve so you will going to get a bit idea that how to solve all the 20 questions to clear the exam very easily so that's it for today we'll meet in the other video and if you are new to my channel then don't forget to subscribe my channel because you will going to get all the updated videos of related to ch on my channel